going to show you how you, you can bulk update Crystal Connections. First log in to 360, go to the menu, select Public Folders. You have the options, first we document the Crystal Connections and then we do the bulk update. So the documentation is here. If I don't select any folders um, and go to Documentation and select the and then click on the crystal documents and instances details if I click on that that will document all crystals in my environment I'll select these folders and on the right hand side under documentation I'll click on the Excel icon under crystal documents and instance details so this is going to export the crystal documents and all their connections um, so the export's done. I'll open my Excel file. Okay, so I get the path of the document, the name of the document, um, the kind of the document. So column E shows whether it's a crystal report, whether it's a recurring instance. So if you have any recurring instances, you'll also want to update those connections. We had customers with a need to also update any of the succeeded instances. So a lot of users will go to history and rerun successful um, jobs. So if you won't have that, you know, they'll complain that it's, it's erroring because the connection won't be correct. So you can bulk update that as well. Okay, so I'm going to scroll all the way to the right. Um, the first thing I want to update is um, column K, the original data source. So I want to set all of these to no because I want it to use my custom data source. Okay, so all of those are set to no for all the ones that I do want to update. If there are any you don't want to update, you can delete them from the file. Okay. So now here are all the options that I have. So from column P through T, these are the columns that I can update. So the driver, the, the server, the database, the user and the password. So any of those columns can be updated. Uh, so for this example I'm just going to update the passwords. I'm going to give all of these a different password. Save the Excel file. Go back to 360. So on the right hand side I'll collapse documentation. So expand administration and here I have the option update crystal connection select that source kind file system upload file select the file and I click apply and that will do the bulk update for me you can also schedule this if you go to tasks administration tasks, create a new task. So if you have a lot of documents you might want to schedule it instead of doing it the way that I did it. Um, you can set it for a later time if you want to do it. Um, maybe I want to schedule it for this Friday. Expand resources, crystal connection update. This is where I select the file system. You've got your template. I can upload my file. So it'll be the same file that I uploaded before. Click apply. And then um, I can set up notifications if I want, trigger events and I add that task, it's pending, that will run um, in a few days according to my schedule. So those are the two ways that you can bulk update Crystal Connection